In this section of my shooting video, I talk all about using backlighting indoors in my work. Um, I love using backlighting um, indoors, especially uh, during sunset um, with one window. Um, this window that is located upstairs in my bedroom, um, it, it just gets the really most beautiful light around sunset. And um, here I was uh, hoping to use um, a little bit of uh, water to keep my daughter, um, just get, to keep her a little bit occupied um, while I was uh, working with her um, with, different, uh, with different lenses, with different perspectives, as well as different angles, um, so that she could stay a little bit occupied in that particular spot. Um, working with a little bit of water, um, what I had over there was uh, she had a little bit of water to play with um, by putting the water on the window, uh, on the glass window. Um, and that just really gave uh, just a unique perspective of um, just getting that natural element of water um, and adding some texture. Um, one of the most important things when photographing um, with backlight indoors is to see um, what you really want to expose in the image in your scene. Um, do you really want to expose your subject in the image? Do you really want to expose for the highlights um, in the frame? Um, and that really is just a really um, important decision that you have to make through your exposure uh, choices. Um, in here, when, whenever I'm photographing using backlight uh, indoors, um, I typically do, um, I do like to change things up um, by uh, changing my settings on the go because the light is really just changing super fast um, while um, I am trying to uh, work with different angles and different perspectives. The light's just moving as uh, fast uh, as fast as uh, it typically does. Um, so in here, um, I was just really getting my daughter to uh, stay busy and um, just uh, change positions, um, change perspectives, uh, change angles, um, and uh, I moved around photographing her um, straight for uh, looking. Uh, directly into the window um, and then after a little bit I moved around um, to just get a little bit of different angles uh, in the image as well. I also turned on the lamp, the uh, lamp light that was sitting right next to her um, on purpose as it started to get a little bit darker um, so as to balance the warmth as well as the coolness the cool light in the frame um, just to add that extra depth. Um, one of the most important points to remember when it comes to photographing backlighting um, is that the last light um, is uh, really beautiful but it just moves super fast and hence you have to uh, re remember to react to your exposure settings and change your exposure settings equally fast as well.